gonna do it. some of these things, and there's no way that the police, that the mayor can allow these police to return to work. You know, somebody, a reporter asked you, what are we going to do if the DA doesn't prosecute? Well, for starters, these policemen are not going to, uh, the mayor is going to have to fire them anyway. How will we get a new DA who will them? I would like, exactly. that would be, you know, maybe the DA will impress us and make a wise decision right now. What's your name, sir? Ken Miller. Miller? Yeah, Kenneth Miller. Kenneth Miller. Kenneth Miller. Kenneth Miller. Yeah. Okay. Mike's not here. What? Oh, yeah, it's still sacred. I'm sorry. It's still a holy cow. He's not a So uh, waiting to hear back. 
he's communicating with our office, but we're also waiting here uh, for the meeting with the leadership of APA, BPAP, Black Folk Empowerment Project, Urban League, okay. and NACP, and, um, and Penn, Penn, Pittsburgh uh, Interfaith Impact Network, Powell uh, Park Center. Thank you. He committed to that. Uh, person is unavailable, we are looking for a response of some sort, um, whether it's a phone call, via letter, to answer questions such as, what is taking so long for this investigation? He gave us a reason a year ago. Um, that reason is now uh, invalid. You know, the Department of Justice is no longer investigating. So um, what is taking him so long to come out and do his job, to come out and prosecute this crime? Is it just because they're police officers? And, um, and, and that is the message that the community doesn't need to be sent, that because they are police officers, that they are above the law. Because if it was any other person, uh, they would have been in jail by now. We're going to switch over for a moment, a technical okay. issue to continue. Okay. Where's the legal area? Right here. Oh, he can't, he can't there. record over there? Yeah, right. Directly okay. in that area. Brandy was just getting warmed up. Yeah, yeah I was, wasn't that? She was just getting warmed up. Love that, Brandy. Come on. Yeah, she's got me sweating already. Excuse me? Let's get you around. Let's give these television. Let's give these television. Uh, right. right. oh, it's, it's okay. okay. Uh, okay. I'm sorry. Okay. 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 There you go. Get the mother in the ground. Oh, Brandy, if you can spell your name and say it again for me. What do you say? It is Brandy Fisher, B-R-A-N-D-I, F-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-S-
was supposed to get back to us after he reviews all the information. And as Brandy has said, and, and here's uh, <laughs> Jordan's mom, Therese Miles, Pat Porter, the grandmother, we're all wondering, what more do they have to do? That's the question. What more do they have to do? It's not that difficult a case from a lay perspective. I almost said something I don't want to say on camera. But they put this young man into a hospital. They cannot defend that. They will never defend that to the community's level of acceptance. understanding and acceptance. They will never do that. Hopefully the DA has enough sense. As Gail Moss said to me today, said to him in a personal conversation, try them. Try them. We're all saying, try them. Because right now you're trying our nerves. And the reason why this, uh, you know, we are committed in this and we keep coming back and we are going to stay around until something is done is that Jordan Miles is a victim. And he was a child at the time in my eyes. I have a son only a year younger than him. Mm. And so, you know, for a child to be victimized like that and um, to have to tell him that this, there's nothing that can be done about it, that this just goes on, um, you know, a child that has done everything right, who has followed all of the rules um, of, the, the, of the law and also of his own home, um, there's no way that this should be able to happen to anyone who just steps outside the door because they live in a community um, that is high crime rate. You know, if he did nothing wrong, the, the police in this case have not supported, have shown any evidence to support their story, period. Nothing in this case supports their version of events at all. And so for them to be able to come out and blatantly lie about evidence that has never appeared and get away with it, to beat him like that, even if the evidence appeared, it's ridiculous. There's no way that DA Zapala does not know that there was a crime committed. There's no way that he still has to look at evidence to figure it out. The pictures show that excessive force was used. The pictures show that. There's no way his head should have been beaten like that, his face should have been that swollen, if they, if they did not use excessive force. And they said they had an excessive force expert come in who is not independent. Nothing in Pittsburgh is independent. The lie detector test that the police officers used was the only thing that was independent. An independent agency who was a relative of a police officer. And they passed that test. But Jordan Miles was subjected to an FBI test. And he passed it. And from my understanding, in the test that the police officers took, they were not even asked about the pop bottle which is the foundation for this entire case. So when we look at the issue, we look at the facts of the case, Jordan Miles has no reason to lie. He's not trying to get out of a crime. He has nothing to hide. There's no reason for the young man to lie. He passed a lie detector test, so he has not lied, which means he did not have a pop bottle, which means the police lied. He claimed, he stated that he did not have a pop bottle at all. So, and he passed that test. So the police said there was a pop bottle. That's perjury. And they never produced it. And they never produced it. They also said they had statements from a witness that claimed that she did not know Jordan Miles. But when she went to court, there is a matter of court record mm -hmm. that there is perjury in this case. Yes. So for you to outright not charge the police, it's letting us know that this is a city ran by the police and not by the local government. Mom, do you have a comment? Yeah. I just, you know, I pray that, that the DA will do the right thing in this case. You know, um, he's not unwise. He knows exactly what happened here. And for him to allow this sort of thing to continue is just, it's just unacceptable. You know, I'm disgusted. Hopefully the next time we come here, he will come out and talk to us. How's Jordan? Jordan is okay. He's doing okay. That's all I can say. See you in school this semester? No. This sign was made by one of our partners, Human Rights Zone. That's what this should be. The court should be a human rights zone. Mm -hmm. Citizens of Pittsburgh and Allegheny County. Mm -hmm. no, so I just thank you all um, for coming out. And the statement and the message that we're trying to make clear is that there is an entire city. We have introduced thousands of signatures to the Zapata of individual citizens requesting that he prosecute these police officers. It's not just a family of Jordan Miles. It's just not one organization. 
thousands of individual citizens who elect him to do his job, and we are requesting that he prosecute these three officers. Let 12 jury members decide whether they are guilty or not. Thanks, guys. Well, um, can I have your name, please? I'm sure we have it back at the station, but I got that guy. have it on tape again, please. Yes, Therese, T E R E Z, Miles, M I L E S. Thank you so much. I'm sorry, I said it one more time. Therese, T E R E Z, Miles, M I L E S. Keelan, K I E L A N, Miles, M I L E S. And your grandma is here? Pat Martin. You get everybody's name, so it's spelled correctly. Patricia Porter. Standard spell. Yes. While we're here, do you have that thing on the tent for the legislation? That's his sister, his grandmother, his sister, and his mom. Oh, the 15th. We have a missile on the other side of the tent. Keenan. K-E-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I-S-A-I